my niece, but apparently I'm a little bitch and all I can do is cry about it. So that's not happening today. <laughs> What is this malarkey that's happening? There we go. Uh, what can I do? What can I do? I'm gonna make a tag video. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a tag video. What's it gonna be called? Um, the Cheyenne's a little bitch book tag. No. Um, hmm. How about the social distancing escape tag? Uh, rules. Rules and regulations. Um, hmm. So in order to do this tag, you have to be outside. You either are in your car, or you're in your yard or on your porch or like at a park. I don't know if parks are open right now in your area, but you have to be alone. And unless you have like a child, in which case like bring your crotch goblin, like whatever. Those are the rules. If it's rainy and gross, get in your car, go for a drive. If you don't drive, uh, sit in a car. You don't have to go anywhere. Just be outside of your house or apartment just or work place because like i'm going to work right now i and i have not been spending a lot of time outside like my ride to work is the most <laughs> like nature i've been getting and i live in the woods <laughs> i just thought of the best way to describe myself so professor chelani if she was a forest witch and drunk all the time that's me <laughs> question number one how are you doing with this pandemic? How you doing? Like, how do you feel about it? How do you feel about how your family and your friends are feeling about it? Like, how, how are you doing? Like, are you okay? Like, what's going on? T tell me about it. That's that's question number one. My answer to that question. Um, well, uh, well, let's be honest. Uh, I'm having a bit of an emotional breakdown. Have been for about four or five days now. <laughs> Question number two, how has the pandemic been affecting your reading? I haven't read anything in two months. So there's that. Question number three, what is the first thing that you are gonna do once everything becomes the new normal? Because things aren't going to go back to normal. That's, you know, that's just the thing. That's the T, as the children say. Once I feel comfortable enough to like, you know, I can show you the world. Probably, honestly, I'm gonna go visit Yumi. If you don't know, Yumi Yumi Yamamoto is a author and also a YouTuber and a booktuber thing. And because of the nature of her husband's job, they travel around the world frequently for like three years at a time or whatever. And she's going to be leaving the United States to go to her next location once, you know, they get the clear on some stuff. And I'm gonna go visit her, I think. I don't know if I'm allowed to talk about where she's going, so I'm not going to say where she's going, but it'll be a real nice vacation, tell you that much. I also would love to go see Allie in Texas, but like they have armadillos, and I would also like to go see Zach and Rachel in Florida, but if I say, hey, I want to come visit you, they're going to be like, so how about you just come to Book Fest? You're so determined to get me to go to that. It's real funny. Has the pandemic made you more or less creative? I've actually found that it's made me more creative. I'm drawing again. I'm doing some digital design stuff again. I'm painting again. I have a lot of video ideas. So while it has put me in a major book slump, I, you know, have had some positive outcomes of this, I guess. Question number five, have your reading plans changed from the beginning of the year to now? I fully planned on reading, I think it was like 75 books. I threw that out the fucking window. Uh, if you missed it, I have a video about how I said a big old fuck you to my Goodreads goal. And I also plan on getting my TBR down to zero. I don't think that's gonna happen either. This is a really depressing tag so far. Let's uh, let's bring some positivity in here. What, what can we talk about? Question number six. What character or characters would you like to be quarantined with and why? I would love to be quarantined with Algar Hart, who is a character that none of you know because none of you have read Yumi Yamamoto's book, Shonen and Serum, which you should hit her up and ask her to do. But he is my dark son and also my husband. So I would love to be quarantined with him. Also, he dirty, like, dirty. Mm. To be on brand, I would also like to be quarantined with James Hook because he would have the best fucking stories. Like, oh my God. Also, Kaylin from The Bone Witch. I reach back out because I love him. Question number seven, how has the weather been for you? 
it's been getting like slowly warmer, which is impressive since at the beginning of this month we had a you know three or four giant snowstorms, and that's going to be 80 degrees today. Um, but then you know I'm also wearing sunglasses, a hoodie, and have my heat on this morning. So Maine, the cold it doesn't bother me. The cold never bothered me anyway. It's the fact that I can't wear one outfit through the whole day. I have to wear layers. Maine weather makes you an ogre. What question am I on? Eight? Question number eight. What has been your go-to quarantine snack? Mine has been tortillas. Not, not anything in them. Just the tortillas. That's what I've had for dinner for the last like three, four, five nights. Question number nine. If there was an author that you could be quarantined with, who would they be and why? I would not choose Rich Peck or Holly Black because I believe both of them have crotch goblins and that's like if you if you were quarantined with them they they would you know you, they would want to bring their children their spawn and that's not something I'm here for but honestly I probably wouldn't want to be quarantined with anybody like other than my actual friends I probably wouldn't want to be quarantined with anybody I live alone should I be saying that on the internet probably not and I am used to living that way now I've been living that way for almost two years I think question number 10 who are two characters you would like to see quarantined together? I would like to see Stevie Bell from the Truly DB series, and I think her name is Kat from Fangirl. I would love to see them quarantined together because they're just, they're little anxious things, and I, and I think they'd be good friends. I think they'd be good, good friends. Question number 11. I think I'm on 11. You can pick two authors to have quarantined together so they can write a book together. What two authors? are they? Dead or alive, doesn't matter. I'm picking Jane Austen and Rin Chapeco. Can you ima- can you imagine? Can you imagine? Oh my god. Question number 12. What are your favorite book quotes? Give me at least three. Because I'm driving and didn't prepare for this. I'm gonna put some, you know, little, like, aesthetic things with the quotes on them here. There will be three. And go. cosplay Rapunzel because I really fucking love Rapunzel. Question number 14. If you could cosplay with your booktube friends, what would you cosplay as? I would love to do a cosplay of that scene from Wreck-It Ralph Breaks the Internet. Ra Ralph, I didn't see it, but I saw the, the clip where, what's her name, goes and finds all like the Disney princesses and like they all have like casual clothes and stuff like that, except Oh god, what's her name? I can't remember her name! This one! Okay? But I want Zach to do a gender-bent version of this one, and then me, Ali, Steph, Diana, and Yumi, and Rachel. <laughs> I want us all to be the princesses. There's a line that she says that I just think Zach would be so great at saying. Were you poisoned? No. Cursed? No. Kidnapped or enslaved? No. Are you guys okay? Should I call the police? Because he is one of the sweetest humans. Like, he is 
such a nice guy. And apparently my camera just fucking stopped recording in the middle of me talking about how great Zach is, but that's what I would like to do. The last and final question is if you could have any wish right now, this isn't like a genie thing, like there's no rules or regulations on this kind of wish, what would you wish for? And my wish would be to be able to read right now. Your wish can be as selfish or, you know, selfless as you want it to be, but what would your wish be? I am tagging Rachel from Reads with Rachel, Stephanie from Miss Richard Reads, Zach's from Jack, Zach tries to read, Yumi from Yumi the Book Demon, Ali from Dog and Ali 394. Uh, Ali, I know you're having issues with your filming and stuff right now, so you can do it on Twitter. And Diana from Paperback Jedi. I also tag you. Consider yourself tagged if you're seeing this. All right, I'm gonna go now. But how do I end these? <laughs> Shit. Have a great day. Don't be a dick. Okay. Bye. <laughs>